Alright, so we're playing Car Trader Simulator. So, that's why we are. Yes. Alright. Now that we got him to calm down. Mage build could be fun. I, I haven't really looked into it. Uh, as far as the gameplay. I hear there's a couple difficult bosses on there. But other than that, it was a really simple game, I guess. I don't know. What are you doing? Quiet! I got it! We're almost there. Okay, this car's good. The scrapyard of my uncle's friend is right behind the stadium. Yeah, I know. Bought my BWM there. Ah, they can't say that one. No. Cops! It was getting us into trouble. Shut up and see if they're catch if they're see if they're catching up. Uh-oh. Take the highway! It would be faster! Run! What did I sign up for? What do you think you're doing? You can't use my scrapyard like that. I'm calling your uncle right now. He'll take you home. And you! I don't want to see you here ever again, you thief. And take this car with you before someone two hours later. Ah. Why are you doing this, boy? If you need money, you can work for me. You sure would be better off than your friend who just got caught. Look, someone put a salvage Jujiro up for sale. Quickly, make a bid before it's gone. Okay. Oh, I thought it was gone. Uh, do I have money? I can't bid. Ah, someone overbid us. Must have been a collector. All right. Find another way to get you a car. Let's focus on something else for now. We need a new garage. Go see what's currently available. Oh, boy. I don't know if I should have agreed to this. Cost a thousand dollars, rent a hundred. Buy. I don't know if I want to buy it. What's this? Nothing. Headquarters. Well, looks like this is the only thing I can buy. Do you want to buy this garage for a thousand dollars? No! Now when we've got some cash, check out the offers and hire a mechanic. I need money. Can I borrow some? Hello? Hello, would not be a good time to talk about your car since you've been working. Yes, 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 I would. Employees. Jack Helpful. Why do I gotta hire this guy? Do you want to hire this employee for zero dollars? Yes. I like zero dollars. Small toolbox. $500 for a small toolbox. Oh my goodness. The car I bought yesterday is ready for pickup. My friend's in town. He can go get it for you and take it to the garage. Once it's delivered to your garage, you have to order him to leave it there. Otherwise, he will keep it on this tow truck. Oh. Wrong button. It won't let me go. Um, that's cool, no, but I can't move. I broke it. Insurance. Did 
I go here? No. Well, it's not where I wanted to go, but apparently that will work. Where are we going? In circles? Okay, we got the car. Run! Alright, tell the mechanic to put up some scrap on his way to the garage. Who's going here? There's nobody at headquarters. Oh, here? No, not here. I can't click anywhere! There's the road. Thank you for the raider. My clicking's broken. Welcome to ASMR. Without Angel. Where's my car? No, no. What are we doing? Nothing successful. Nothing there. Are you sure? No. No, because I don't know what I'm doing. SpongeBob. How do I get my car? Drag this over? No. Hmm. Where's the guy? I thought he was here. 
<gasps> We're moving! Don't know why there's such a delay on moving. This game is very, um, different. Great. Now that you've got the scrap, send him to the garage. Then you should order him to start repairing the car. Better repair it completely. Okay. Yay! Now we're moving again. Man, oh man. Uh-oh. Car. Ooh, who broke this car? No mechanic assigned. Choose a mechanic. I have a mechanic. $2,490. Does not look fixed. Oh, it's working on it. Okay. This is weird. Hello? Hello? Hello, would not be a good time to talk about your car since you weren't Yes. Yes. Why did you break the car? I didn't. It was um called in to go pick up a car. I don't know. Bloop. Little birds told me one woman loves red cars. That's all she cares about. So let's just paint the one we have. Okay. Red. There we go. Paint. Don't forget to reward your employees for their work. That mechanic sure deserves a promotion. I haven't gotten paid yet, buddy. He leveled up. Remember to adv advertise your cars. Because I'm supposed to break cars. That's why I broke it. Ah, the red button's not working. There we go. Alright. Create an ad for $500. That's a lot of money for an ad for a car. How much money am I making? 23202 Minus the 500 Okay, so we got $1,000 for the purchase price. $39.90 for repairs. So that will give me $21,093 profit. I can increase the price! Oh my goodness, we're all going to be rich. Your client's calling you. The ad must be working. Hello? Mm-hmm. Hello? Hello, would not be a good time to talk about your car since you weren't I want to sit down. Let me check. Um... If the customer's unhappy with the price, offer him another one. You need to bargain. Try to convince the client by answering the questions. If you succeed, then make your an offer. Um, this is what I got. If you say it's that good, does this car drive? Absolutely! Truth or lie? Oh. It's an industrial secret they never break. Or lie. Oh. Uh-oh. I can't lie! Oh. It's an industrial secret. They never break. Wicked. Is left mirror looking good? Just look at it. It's perfect. Not bad. How much does this cost? Um... The value is twenty-one thousand, and we're trying to sell it for twenty-five. This little monster is twenty-five thousand three hundred and twelve dollars. Oh. Well, you overpaid. 
Just keep in mind, all your actions have consequences. Sure, you can sell a damaged car, but your reputation matters. Cheating and dealing with the wrong people will get you in trouble. Oh, boy. Great, you can advertise your store, too. Just like you did it with the cars. And now you're ready to make some profit. Oh, boy. So we made $20,822 on that car. Ads. $8,000 for an ad. Oh, it's TV time. Do you want to buy this ad for $8,000? Not really. I'd like to renegotiate it. If you're running out of cash, you can take out a loan. Each loan has different consequences. There's no room for mistakes here. Let's take a payday loan. It's a very high interest loan, but if your uncle... But I'm your uncle, so you can get away with it this time. Oh, boy. What if I don't want a loan? $10,000! Oh, boy. No, I want the $10,000 one. Don't. No, no, no. Oh. oh, okay. If you want to know how everything works, you can open an encyclopedia. We can't read. There you can find detailed in the explanation of every aspect of a car trader profession. Take all the time you need. We will continue to work when you're ready. All right, so now we got to go get a, a container. Where's my car? Oh! Shipment arrive in seven minutes. Great, now we gotta get there in time. Sometime later. Did I need insurance? Trader offers you a container that it's here! Let's open it! It's in the docks and it's waiting for the action. Fingers crossed! A Kim Spirit! Worth $8,505. Oh my goodness. The trader offers you a container that someone has given up. It is the expensive. Oh, it is expensive, but it comes from the proven source. I'll arrive in a few weeks. How much did I pay for that? No. What? No what? <laughs> uh oh. You gotta go down there, right? There it goes. Hiya, yoy. Hello. Hello, would not be a good time to talk about your car since you're horny. No. Hey, might know what title I have on there today, huh? <laughs> And my problem with the explosive thingy is I don't know which program it's in. Now you can drop the cars in your garage. So that one's only 8,000. I don't know. What is this? Is that parts? Scrap? I 
Another way to boost your finances is to sell your cards to a collector. Let's check out and see what they're looking for this week. Oh boy. Hey, they're looking for the car I got. So he wants it in a green Kim Spirit. That's exactly what we have received in this container from the docks. Yay! Good job. Now we can pick the car and deliver it to the collector. He's usually paying over 50% more than a regular customer. Yay! Why do I go back? Oh, wrong click. There we go. Hi, yo, yo. We're there. Let's hire a thief. Okay. Do you want to hire this employee for zero dollars? Absolutely! You can rename your employee by clicking on their name. So! Wait, can I do it? No, I want to! If you're using thieves, you can send them on a patrol. This way they can save a lot of time because you don't have a manager. You don't have to manage them all the time. Try it out now! Um, one, two, or three. Two! No, go to. Oh, shift click. Great job. Now he's going from one point to another the way you marked. It's easier to find abandoned cars on the street this way. You know how to manage your thief now. Let's find a car and make some profit. It's not entirely legal, but hey, not every month is full of cash, right? I should move my camera. That was quick. Now the thief have to break in and bring it to the garage. Hold on. I gotta move my camera. I'm gonna move it up a little. I don't want to move it in Angel's camera when she decides to show up. Where is Angel's camera? Oh, okay. It's over there. Where's my camera? There it is. Up, 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 up. All right, there we go. That looks a little bit better. <laughs> All right. Hey, ASD, how are you today? Hold on, I'm stealing the car. Oh, there's a couple of them here. Yo! Oh, come on! Oh, he was sent to prison. Oh. That's the Oblos Police Department brought new BMWs so they're faster than your thief that's not fair 
Why do they get new BWMs? Oh no, not again. They caught your thief. Now you have some time to pay the bail. Be careful, if you run out of time, the thief will be sentenced. If you pay the bail, you only lose his equipment. He didn't have any equipment. We got four minutes to pay his bail. Three thousand dollars! Give your thief a break. Send him to the headquarters. Oops, wrong button. Man. What? Why is he injured? He just got out of jail. My poor employee. He's not a, he's a very clumsy thief. All right. Now that the thief is in the hospital. Seven and a half minutes. Look, one of your employees got injured. You have to wait for him to recover until you can see him again. You can lock your phone so it doesn't drop down every time you move your mouse. Simply lock it by pressing the button. Okay. Now unlock it to drop it down. Really? I prefer the classic face-to-face -face selling, but there's an app in the phone where you can buy cars. Open your phone and click on the browser button. I don't know, did it crash? I dropped the dick spur crate. That's right. Here. Unless it got claimed already. Let's look. Nope, didn't get claimed. I can claim it. I don't know why. Uh, open your phone. Now open LMG Scout and buy a car. How am I going to remember that name? I don't even know how much... I got three thousand dollars. Three thousand dollars, that's it. Are you sure you want to buy this car? No, but it doesn't give me an option. Great. You can do the same thing with dark cars, but this site is very not very legit. Pick up the car with your driver and bring it to the garage. Okay. You bought a Jetson! Because I'm not gonna try to butcher that. Oops. Here to there. Oh, I hope it's not a stolen car that I just bought because that would be horrible. Because my thief is in jail or in the hospital. Okay, picked it picking it up. We're picking up a car. And now we take it to the garage. Drop car. Great! You can not only buy cars on the app, but you can also sell them. It's very tricky for an old man like I am, but if you're what if you're taking the mafia path and you don't have a lot of lawfulness, you can sell stolen cars there. Try it out. I'll give you one for free. Let's put it up and see if we can get some cash. Okay, we bought it for two thousand. Did they want some pretty monies on these cars? Twenty-three thousand dollars. Okay. Are you sure you want to put this car up? No. Do I have a choice? Some time later. Two clients interested in your car. Let's check the offers. One will pick it up 
in half a week, and the other one, well, a week and a half. Be careful, once you accept an offer, you cannot cancel it. Oh, man. <coughs> Pick it up in half a week, and the other one, well, a week and a half. Okay. <coughs> Thank you for the Raider. Click offers. 15,000 or 16,000? Oh, man. That's not a lot of money. They're undercutting me. I guess we'll go with this guy. You know that you can rename your garage. Try it out and open the garage and click on the window title. Oh, what are we naming our garage? <laughs> we named our thief Soup, so they thought he went to the hospital. Well, name it question mark. Oh, wrong screen. Ah, uh, no. Uh, torture. No, torture is not nice. <laughs> Rusty pipes. You steal it, we peel it. Well, I don't get a motto. <laughs> Ow. Rusty pipes. Good job. There's one more building where you can make profit. A car dealership. Simply drop a car here or there with your driver and you'll find a client in no time. Don't worry, it will sell automatically, but you'll get 90 to 100% value of the car. A mo motto. Like, um, you know, a slogan. Hello? Hello, would not be a good time to talk about your car since you've been working. No. I'm trying to sell rusted pipes. That's probably one of the worst dead. Oh. It saves you time, and if you're an introvert, you don't have to speak with the client. It's a win win situation. That's probably one of the worst dad jokes ever. Do you want to buy this car dealership for $500? Yes? I, I, I only got $500 left! Oh, we got a loan taken out still. This car? This guy? This car? Oh wait, no, that car's going to be sold to the other place. Ah, refrigerators. There we go. Bloop. Good job. Bloop bloop. If you want to think about your next auction or take a break, use the pause button at the bottom of the screen. I was looking for that earlier. That's helpful when you have several auctions at the same time. I was looking for that earlier because we had a doohickey, whatchamacallit, battle. Game paused. Yay! I got an achievement unlocked. Congratulations, you have finished the tutorial section. Now you can start a campaign or play Sandbox. Oh boy. <laughs>